Brett, tomorrow presents an opportunity for your group to respond against Dallas. What are you looking forward to seeing from this team? Yeah, I think it's a good situation for us. Quick practice today, get in, afternoon game tomorrow. I think everyone everyone likes those. You know, you don't think too much. You just wake up, have a good meal, and, and get on the ice and go play. So I think that's, that's going to be good for our group. Um, yeah, we're in... This is new to us right now. We've been, you know, we didn't lose a game for so long. So when you lose, it feels, you know, it doesn't feel good. And uh, but, you know, we're taking games. Uh, I think we're doing eight, eight games at a time, and we're focusing on winning five of those, and and that'll put us in a good spot and put us in the postseason. So that's that's our main focus. We know we're not going to win every game uh, to finish out the year, but I think just to keep our confidence. We know we're, we're a top team in the league, and. Uh, that's that's the biggest thing, you know. You can't get frustrated when we're we're not playing to our best. Just keep feeling good and uh, stick together and, and keep playing our game, and, and we'll win a lot of games. You'll face a Dallas team that just put up nine goals in one game last night. How do you go about combating that, especially as a decor, being able to limit those chances? Yeah, it's yeah. I saw that too. They put up uh, a lot of goals. Uh, any team's got that ability, you know. So if if you're soft on defense, they're they're going to put the puck in the net on you and. Um, so I think, yeah, that's something, you know, when, when we were winning games, we are giving up one, two goals against, and, and it's not going to be every night, but uh, we want that to be the, the majority of the nights for sure. How much do you feel like it's a good test for this group? You kind of talk about maybe there's an extra little bit of heaviness with these losses, of course, with the 16-game win streak and now experiencing these losses. A test for you guys to be able to really see kind of what this team is made of. Yeah, I think it's good. It's a... Uh, a reminder: You just got to take the take it one day at a time throughout the season. It's a long season. The games, you know, we're, we're especially getting busy now with games, and you got to what's done is done with the loss. Even even period by period, you know, you have a bad period, you got to park it and move on. So, it's a it's a good reminder for us. Uh, when, when you're winning 16 in a row, it's everything's feeling good. It feels like you you might never lose, but the reality is you, you lose games and you have bad periods and and things go wrong. So it's just uh, working through that. Uh, Chris is talking about group staying relaxed after such an emotional game last night. Just coming to practice today, what's the kind of the, the approach when you, when you're looking to kind of you know turn the page from a, such an emotional game? And yeah, I think it's just do what you do individually to prepare for the next one. And you know, uh, yeah, we're busy. It's a quick turnaround. We'll have a flight today and, and game. We'll be playing the game tomorrow before we know it. So you got to get your rest. That's that's important too to feel, to feel good and, and have the jump you need. So I think yeah, you know, stay relaxed, stay composed. Uh, get ourselves ready and uh, but rest up and get ready to go when the puck drops.